know it's a teepee? Teepee. Really, really big. Really, really big. Teepee, okay. That's cool. Like right over here. Right here. All right, what'd you have over here? Where was it? Pyramid. A pyramid? Like, where was it? Where was it at? Where was where was the pyramid at? <laughs> where is it at? Where is the pyramid? You squished it. Where was it supposed to be? Right there. Right here? It's supposed to be right here? Right there. You squished it. I stepped on it, I'm sorry. Alright, I tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna snap my fingers and I'm gonna restore it. I'm gonna enhance it, I'm gonna make it better. You ready? What's this? <laughs> what do you think of it now? It's, mine was better. <laughs> okay, but it still, still looks good? Yeah. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, I've never done it before, so I'm not as good as you. I can tell. <laughs> well, well. All right, that's cool. that's cool. Let's give another round of applause. <laughs> All right, I don't have any closure eyes for just a moment. Go ahead and close your eyes once again. Sand is gone, everything is gone there. But on the count of three, you're going to be a competitor in a brand new Olympic event. You're going to be an athlete in a brand new Olympic event. You get to decide on whatever type of event, any type of event you can imagine that you want to compete in, that's what you get to do. On the count of three, though, you're going to sit up straight. You're going to open eyes. On the count of three, one, two, three, go and sit up straight, open eyes, a brand new Olympic competitors. <laughs> All right. What do we What do we got over here? What are we doing? Underwater basket weaving. You don't see that very often. Okay. Very, very skilled underwater. Do you need any scuba gear? You already got the scuba gear? I can breathe. Yeah, that's just like a mermaid, of course. Just like a mermaid. Okay, keep doing that. That's good. And what do we got? What do we got over here? Balance beam walking. Balance beam? Oh, very good. It's got some good balance. Mm -hmm. How high off the ground is that supposed to be? Uh, three feet. About three feet off the ground? Okay. Hey, uh, how big is the basket supposed to be? Like this big. So it's, can you tell me about your technique? It's like a pie. It's folded and folded and circle. And you flip it and fold it. Up and fold it, okay. That's cool. Let's give him a round of applause. All right, you can take your seat. You can take your seat for just a moment. Let me uh, let me talk to the, the judges and see what the results are. Let's see what the judges say. All right, I've got the results. And it looks like both of you won the gold medal in your event. You won. Let me take a souvenir photo with you holding your gold medal. Just stand up, both of you, let's just kind of get together. Let me take a nice group photo here with you holding your... <laughs> Yeah, gold medal. Now these will be available on my hip, uh, Facebook page, Hypnotist Kerry Sharp, if you want to check these out for later. Let's give them another round of applause, though. All right, you can put those gold, you can leave them on your neck or you can put them in your pocket, say whatever you need to put them. Is that, do you want to just leave them, keep them on? Okay, okay. All right, I got, another, I got one more thing for you. Now this time, volunteers, when I snap my feet, when I snap my fingers, you're gonna look out there into the audience, and anybody wearing red or pink is gonna give out the best smell, your favorite smell. You're gonna to wanna to check this out. Anything that's red or pink is, but if anything, red or pink gives out the best, your favorite smell. On the count of three, one, two, three, go and sit up straight, open your eyes, too good. The closer you get, the better. Just take a moment, go check that out. There's even an umbrella right there. Oh, there's a lady over there with a the red jacket. That's really good.
Seat, sir, take a seat. All right, what'd you smell over here? What was it? Popcorn. Some popcorn? Oh, yeah. All right, what'd you have? Cookies. Was it the same thing each time? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's give him another round of applause. One more thing for you, volunteers. I got one more thing. A cool trick. Anyone want to see? Want to see a cool trick? All right now, you see my hand. You see my fist. Now, volunteers. Anytime I open up my hand, there will be fire coming out of my hand. You'll be safe. You won't get hurt, but you'll see it. You ready? Watch this. You ready? Watch this. Here, take. Take. A, are you familiar with dragons? No? Okay. Take a look, keep your up here towards the ceiling. Watch this. Watch this. <laughs> Alright, you know what? I'm gonna switch it. It's no longer fire, it's now water. Summertime. No? Okay, tell you what. I'm going to dry everything out back to normal with this microphone. Watch this. <laughs> All right, I got one more thing for you. Now, this time, volunteers, whatever I point my finger at, there will be a lightning or electricity coming out of my finger. Once again, you'll be safe. You won't get hurt. Let's check this out. Stand right over here. Come stand right here. Stand up. Are you right-handed or left-handed? Right. Right hand? Okay, so make a fist with your right hand. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to transfer this power to your hand. Yeah. And then I'm going to have you write your name across the stage. So you just point your finger and you write your name. And then when you're done writing your name, I'll take it back. Sound good? Ready? Go ahead. You done? Okay. All right, what's your name? Ruthie. Ruthie? Okay. All right, Ruthie. So now everybody that's going to come onto this stage is going to see Ruthie. Good. You totally left your mark here at the fair. I do. <laughs> you did. You did. All right, all right. You can take your seat. Let's give her a round of applause.